Hello friends, I am Sansur Raja from Management Tamila. In this video, we will take a look at how to use the COUNTIF function to solve a common problem. How to find values in one list that appear in another list. How to find values in a list that don't appear in another list. Let's take a look. In this worksheet, on the left, I have a list 1, which contains 7 names. On the right, I have a list 2 which contains 20 names. How to figure out the names which appears in the list 1 which also appears in the list 2? There are several functions to address this problem. Example, view lookup or index match to find the exact matches. Count if is also a powerful and a simple to, to address this problem. For executing county function, we need to indicate range and criteria. Range is the names which are in the list number 2. I need to log this reference to avoid changing while copying this formula by clicking F4. Come on. Then criteria. Criteria is simply the names which is in the current row. If I copy down this formula to have the values in the rest of the cell. Now we get a value of 0 and 1 for the different names. The 1 which indicates the names which is also appears in the list 2. The 0 is it which indicates the names which does not appear in the list number 2. By selecting these cells, status bar shows that the names which appear in both of the list. Okay. Now we will find the names which appear in the list 1 which does not appear in the list 2. So I am deleting this but copying the countif function in the same cell. So for executing the reverse logic, I need to use if function. By wrapping the countif function by the if function, I have to give the count equal to 0 result on 1. If not, it result to 0. Let's copy down this formula to the rest of the cell. So by reversing this logic by a function, we got the different value. The one which indicates that which does not appear in the list 2. The red which indicates that which is appears in the list 2. So this problem shows the flexibility and utility of the counting function. Thank you. Let's see in the next video.